Solana, Sol against BTC. Solana against BTC. We are very close to the CNP incline. But at the same time, this is also a squeeze. You see this? Something like a squeeze as well. So, yeah, there could be a breakout towards the upside. But at the same time, we are touching the skinny pink line. This is not good though, to be honest. We would prefer Sol BDC to stay above the skinny pink line. There could be a rally, right? Clearing all these clusters of buys for Sol against BDC. Right, going up to this noisy area over here. But not take, taking out the highs over here, right? But not forming a new all-time highs. So, yeah, we could do something like this. And then we come back down under the skinny pink line. Bear season starts once we come back down under the skinny pink line again. This is really a preview of what's to come. So you got to be very, very careful about rushing to a trade for Sol BDC. Against USD, Sol is also touching the skinny pink line. Right? We are not completely under it yet. Ethereum is pretty weak. Let's say, for example, if you look at Sol USD, okay, let's look at this, against FUSD, right? You will see that Sol is fairly strong, right? Stronger. We're already forming a new all-time high against Ethereum. So Sol against Ethereum is still above the skinny pink line. So if you want to pick a, a large cap coin to put in your money, I would say Sol is uh, looking pretty good, much better than Ethereum. Anyway, for Sol against USD, we have a target over here. Ta-da! $220. Reason being, there is a inverse hand shoulders over here. At the same time, you can call this an ascending triangle. Right. But at the same time, we're also touching the skinny pink line really feel comfortable about this um, and if anything if we were to you know put on a long for Sol against USD this is where we're getting out we are not too sure whether if Sol is going to be breaking the highs over here right if we could break the high stay above it then yes we could be anticipating more much much more upside for Sol USD but uh, we're already touching the skimping line one, th one thing which I don't really like so yeah I, I think the, the whales are trying to clear all these clusters of buys first Boop. and then we come back down under the skinny pink line. This could be the brutal, brutal fall for um, Sol. So watch out for this, right? We can still go long, but you got, you got to know what you're doing and you got to have proper um, risk management.